Hello everyone and welcome to the One Man Renegade Podcast YouTube channel. I'm your host, Jan Bergreg B, and today we are doing some more, opening up some more of these packs from this Tops, uh, 2002 Top Series 2 M Major League Baseball Hobby Box. Uh, if you missed part one, head on up there, check it out. While you're at it, head on down, hit that uh, notification bell. Well, hit the subscribe button first, then hit the notification bell. The thumbs up, like the video, hit that share button, and share this with everyone you know. Head on over to the comments and say hi. Uh, tell me what your favorite card is I pull out of today's video or just in general what your favorite card is from 2002 or something. I don't know. Whatever you want to talk about, just say hi if that's all you want to do. And then uh, check out the links in the description for my blog, podcast, other social media as well. Um, yeah, let's just dive into it. We've got nine more packs to go. Another stack of packs. Didn't do so hot the first time around, so hopefully we do better today. We're still on the lookout for the Joe Maurer rookie card along with a couple other uh, rookie card, Rich, Rich Harden, uh, some couple other ones. Those are the big ones, though. Mauer. Mauer is really the biggest one. Uh, but also looking for insert cards and possible autograph cards and stuff. We didn't really get much of anything in the first time out. We got a, we got a, um, we got a, what did we get? Um, a gold card. That was pretty much it. Oh, you know what? I totally missed that on the top. Overall autograph and relics is one out of 117. So it's actually better than Series 1. Huh, that's weird. I don't know how that math... Oh, okay. Because that was... All right, I get it, I get it, I get it. I totally missed that last time. See, because last time on the Series 1 packs, it was down at the bottom. But I was looking down at the bottom, it says overall autograph cards, 1 in 283. And then Relic was like 190-something. But I guess if you combine those, it's 117. All right, so I guess the odds are better. Now I think about it. So all right, let's do it. Let's get an autograph then. Ah, oh, that's weird. So, like, much like the first pack of last time out, maybe it's just that top row of packs. These cards are sticking together pretty badly. Um, but then the rest of the packs were fine. Maybe it's just that top row for some reason. Um, but we got Kevin Millwood, Tony Clark, Ramon Martinez. But not that Ramon Martinez, the other Ramon Martinez. Yeah. Not the pitcher. That's Pedro's brother, the other Ramon Martinez. Marcus Giles, Eric Owens, Tori Hunter, Javi, Javier Lopez. Not to be confused, Javi Lopez. Wait, he, but he he was Javi Lopez. Not to be confused, Javi, the other Javier Lopez, the pitcher. <laughs> so confusing. Why do they have to have the same names? Uh, Matt Anderson, we got Shane Reynolds, and then uh, Chris Richard rounding things out there. All right, so hopefully that first pack, similar to the last video, was like, the first pack in the last video where that first pack stuck and then everything else is fine. Let's just hope, but mm, I don't know. We'll see. Kind of weird though. How? Why was that first pack and then everything else is fine? And I don't know. Yeah, these, they're still sticking a little bit. Yeah. We got Rob Brahas, Kenny Lofton, Kurt Schilling, who we talked about last time out. Last year of eligibility for the Hall of Fame. Will he get in? Will he not? I don't know. If he doesn't get in, it's different than, than like, say... Bonds or Clemens because those guys aren't getting in because the steroid stuff. Schilling wouldn't just get in because people don't like him and maybe some of his uh, political ideals and Nazi paraphernalia collecting are, you know, it's World War II collecting, but it includes the Nazi stuff that people don't like. And obviously he, you know, the whole uh, Studio 38 stuff with the Rhode Island and everything. I don't want to get into it, but Mike Piazza is a Hall of Famer. Andy Pettit who was borderline, but obviously had these issues with HGH. Um, gold card, unfortunately, a little bit of paper loss because of stickiness, out of 202, 2002. We got Ichiro, MVP winner uh, from 2001. We got Todd Helton, who, meh, borderline Hall of Famer, I'd say. I don't, I, I don't think he, he's not going to get in, but he had a pretty solid career. Antonio Alfonseca, Brian Daubach. And then Nefi Perez round things out there. Yeah, so I don't, I, I'm really confused. It's like the first pack stuck, and then the rest of them were fine last time. This time the first pack was really bad. These ones are, but these ones are, eh. We got Ryan Klesko, Michael Tucker, uh, Kazuchi Ishii. We got Herb Perry. Pa Paulo Arias, Dan Phillips, 
Arizona Diamondbacks, Steve Sparks, Cincinnati Reds, and another one of these uh, contest cards. As I almost knock over the camera. Oh, wait, something was sticking. Ryan Klesko, you got Dave Veris sticking to Ryan Klesko there. All right, I don't, I'm confused. The stickiness, I don't get it. I don't get it. I know it's a thing, and, and you know, I obviously going into a box like this from this time period, you're gonna have to worry. You have to worry about it. But um, I thought we were in the clear after that last last stack, where the first pack was crap, but then the rest were fine. But this 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 uh, this stack hasn't been quite as good. But let's see what we can get. All right, we got Bill Koch. Uh, to uh. Chu Soshi Shingo, Shing, sure, yeah, Orlando Hernandez, Tom Gordon, uh, Willis Roberts, uh, Omar Vizquel gold glove card, uh, of course, he was, he was always winning gold gloves, Put Brooke Fordyce, we got Robert Person, uh, Felix Martinez, and the Boston Red Sox, around things out there. Again, no inserts so far. Like, what are the inserts? Why are we not getting any in inserts? Um, what are we even looking for? World Series highlights. Player reprints. I don't know. Maybe there's just not a lot of inserts in Series 2 as opposed to Series 1 or something. I don't know. I feel like we should have gotten something. So, yeah. Something already. Um... Kip Wells, Jose Canseco, Matt Clement, Craig Wilson, Ben Grieve, Orlando Cabrera, Steve Cox, Matt Morris, D'Angelo Jimenez, and Tino Martinez. All right, let's see what else we can get. All right, we got Wilton Guerrero, Brian Giles, Vernon Wells, Adam Dunn, Terry Adams, Mike Hill, Greg Colburn, Seattle Mariners, Tim Hudson, and Jose Ortiz. And a checklist. There's a rod. Ooh, we finally got a finally got a uh, insert coming up. Uh, we got Pedro Astacio, uh, Joe McEwen, Jason Schmidt, and we got a. Insert of Randy Johnson, an all-world team card. Scott Rowland. Brett Roenberg. Sean Chacon. The Philadelphia Phillies. And Milwaukee Brewers and an E-Tops uh, ad. All right, we got a couple more packs for today. Again, come back next week. We'll do another stack of packs. Hopefully those don't stick. I, I really don't know. It's, it's weird. I don't quite understand it. Uh, but come back every day, too, for uh, more videos. I got videos, videos posted every day, multiples sometimes. Um, all right, we got Steve Carse, John Halama, Kelly Stinnett. Sticking to somebody. Adam Eaton, the pitcher, Adam Eaton. And then we got Jackie Robinson, uh, 1952 World Series throwback. It's a cool-looking card. Uh, Roberto Alomar, who is a Hall of Famer. Uh, Bill Hasselman. Then we got uh, Jay Buhner. David DeLucci. And our last card in there is a Russ Johnson. Sorry, we're down to our last pack for today. Still looking for that Mauer. We got a couple inserts, though, finally. So that's cool. This pack did not want to open. <laughs> we got so to 
Taguchi. Uh, Mo Vaughn. We got Nomar. Throw Nomar in down. Chris Gomez, Brent Abernathy, Aaron Rowan, Toby Hall, Bubba Trammell, Miguel Batista, and Nick Birdrode. Bird Bird All right, that's going to do it for today. I mean, we did get a couple inserts. Uh, Randy Johnson, All-World Team, and Jackie Robinson, 1952. And we also got another gold card, Andy Pettit. Fortunately, some stickiness and paper loss that we didn't really have too bad last time other than that first pack. But this time, it was all throughout the packs. Which is, I don't quite understand how one pack, one stack is basically fine. The other stack is not. Uh, well, you know, fingers crossed that the next two stacks are better. And hopefully we can find that Joe Maurer uh, rookie card. So thank you everyone for watching. Stay safe. Have fun. Come back next week. Subscribe, like, share. Come back every day actually. But more, come next week for more of this. And uh, thank you for watching. Stay safe. Have fun. Talk to you next time. Bye.